Let, let's make it official, Snipe. Let's make it official. If we're going to talk about this, then screw it. Let's do this with the newest edition of the NHL mascots. Let's do the tier ranker. Let's see if I can find a list of uh, NHL mascots tier list. Let's see if there is one that is already up. And I don't think I don't think this one's missing one, which is fine. Obviously, it uh, it will not have buoy. But I got to be honest, Bowie is like instant F tier. <laughs> I'm sorry. It is. It's like instant F tier. Look at it. Like, I don't care. Like I said, I don't care about the Fremont troll. I don't care that, you know, hey, certain teams have mascots and they, they don't really matter or like are relevant to the team. And here, let's. Let's switch it over to this bad boy really quickly, right? Like, for example, Sparta Cat. Sorry, Sens fans. Sparta Cat is F tier. What the fuck does Sparta Cat have to do with the Ottawa Senators? Nothing. Sparta Cat is F tier, and so is Bowie. I know it's named after Jim Hunter. Hunter for the Oilers is F tier. What the hell even is that? And again, I stand by my point that, like, Initially, when I saw Gritty, I'm like, what the hell is this? Initially, I would have had Gritty around here. And over time, I was proven to be wrong. And Gritty's an S-tier mascot, 100%. Actually, Gritty, Gritty's an A-tier. Gritty's an A-tier, let's be honest. Um, even, you know, even Chance, like, you don't have much to do about the Vegas Golden Knights. But you get it, it's Vegas, it's a desert, it's a, it's a lizard Oh, it's not a lizard. It's a pa -pa -pa. it's a lizard. Like it's fine, and that's the only argument you can make for our Fremont troll friend is that well, it has to do with Seattle, kind of. If it's an homage to a statue that was put under a bridge to stop homeless people from sleeping there in the nineties. Like, I get the idea of, like, the homeless population of Seattle reclaiming it and the city reclaiming it as a fuck you, like, you know, support people who need the most help. I get that. Is that is that the mascot you want, though? I mean, I guess if, you, if you're having it with that intention, it's good meaning. But, like, I don't know what I find more off-putting about this particular mascot. I don't know if it's the nose, like the 17 different shades of blue. The hair that looks like you were at a fucking poison concert in the rain and Brett Michaels is just like, oh God, how are you going to fucking brush that out? Like, I don't know, man. I don't know. There's something about it. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. So like I said, at best, you could put it in like C tier with chance, but I'm sorry. It belongs in the F tier with Sparta Cat and with Hunter. It does. And then there's Stanley C. Panther, who's who's dope. Not quite gritty level. Not quite gritty level. And then there's the Buffalo Sabres. And it's like, okay. You're a you're a tiger. <laughs> you go in F tier. Like you're a tiger for the Sabres. Stop it. Stop it. God, a lot of mascots in the NHL are terrible, aren't they? Jesus. Jesus. At least with the Kings, it's like, okay, it's it's a lion. The king of the... It's like, okay, it's fine. It's fine. So, like, by default, Nashville with Nash at least gets a B because it's a saber-toothed tiger. The New Jersey Devil is A tier. Dare I say S tier. Dare I say S tier. Dare I say, Harvey the Hounds? I want to say D. Uh, I want to say D tier, but there is the one time he got his tongue ripped off, and it was hilarious. He's C tier. Minnesota's mascot. It's like, what the hell even are you? What are you? Uh, it's, uh, it's just the most generic thing. It's like you're related to Sparta Cat, practically. What the hell? Leafs fans, you already know. You already know where the fuck Carlton goes. Jesus. 
freaking polar bear nonsense. Wild Wings A tier as well. Tommy Hawk, you already know it's F tier because the the mat number one. Actually, you know what? Tommy Hawk is A tier because that's what your goddamn logo should be. Tommy Hawk is A tier. Change the goddamn logo to reflect Tommy Hawk. Fucking idiots. Uh, they have an octopus in Detroit. We're going B tier. Arguably A tier. Uh, we're going Harvey the, Harvey the Hounds at least B or A tier. At least. At least. I might I might change these up. Yuppie's F tier. We already know this. We already know this. Yuppie is F tier. I get it. He's been around for so long. The Expos. Everyone's like, oh yeah, Yuppie. It's great. Yuppie is F tier. You know he's F tier. You might love him as an S tier, but deep down in your heart, you know that Yuppie is F tier. Don't try to argue it. Don't try to argue it. You'll just look like an emotional fool. Don't try to argue it. Just like Sparky the Dragon is F tier. Just like Sparky the Dragon is F tier. It's in the same vein as... Do I need to show you the picture again? It's in the same vein as this. Look at this. We are allowing this to happen. Why? Why are we allowing this? I feel like I'm uh, Endo's fucking two seconds away from calling me the Alex Jones of NHL mascots for fuck's sake. Like, why are we letting this happen? Look at this. Why? Why is this a mascot currently? Like, whatever. Live your life, mascot. I'm not offended by your existence. You're just an FTR mascot. Infer Wars 2024. <laughs> Stinger is A tier because it's Stinger and he's dope. Howler, A tier. Howler is A tier. No, I'm not going to grab my Howler bobblehead. Uh, the Caps mascot, by default, is B tier. It's an eagle. It's great. Iceberg, S tier. Iceberg was in a fight with Jean Claude Van Damme. S tier. Sharks mascot, by default, is B tier. Thunderbug, you're still C tier. You're kind of you're kind of shit. Uh, you got this lovable bastard. In St. Louis, I don't really know what the hell he has to do with anything else. You're going D tier with Minnesota. Carolina has a pig, which I think is funny, so it's S tier. Victory Green is the knockoff of the Philly Fanatic. You're in D. Blades is S tier. You already knew that. Uh, the Canucks mascot's A tier. Old Finn. And, uh, yeah, old, old Mickey Moose. That's going to be B tier. You want to be towards the top. And again, some of these are debatable. They are arguable. What is not arguable is that right now, the F tier has a new addition. And that is this thing right here. <laughs> the Seattle Troll. <sighs> named Bowie. You see? Because they're on the water. I happen to be on the other coastline from Seattle. Ha ha, it's Bowie. Oh, the Bruins going to introduce the new mascot fucking lobster trap? God damn, here comes Muck Boot. It's just a giant clam digging boot. Like, I, I just, I don't, why? Like, you had a slam dunk with the Kraken. And you could have pissed off Red Wings fans. Being like, um, we already had an octopus mascot, so, um, ahem. <laughs> and then people could have gotten into fights about that. And what more do we love on the internet than a good fight over superfluous bullshit? I rest my case, Your Honor. F-tier mascot that I guarantee four years from now, I'm going to put an A-tier just like Gritty. God damn it. Shout out, by the way, to uh, to Popcorn Chicken on 38 months. Hunter needs to be a D simply because he's jacked and can totally kick the shit out of the other F tiers. Let's examine that. Let's examine that. If there was a fight, am I taking Sparta Cat or Hunter? Hunter. Am I taking Hunter or this thing? Hunter. I'm taking a polar bear over Hunter. Like, I have Carlton the Bear in F tier. Which isn't fair. I, I'd probably put him more in D tier because one, he's cute. Two, polar bears are dope. Um, at the same time, 
I don't want to offend the polar bear by putting him in a tier with this nonsense. And for that matter, Sparky the Dragon goes up to D as well. Spartacat, Hunter, the Saber's Monstrosity, and Yuppie are F tier. You've heard it here first. But polar bears are monstrous killers. So by default, Harvey and company still stay... Or not Harvey, but fucking Hunters still stay there. How is Harvey the Hound C tier? Because it's fucking ridiculous. Oh, you see, because it's the flames. And he's like a he's he's like a, a dog that you'd find at the at the fire station. Is he setting the fires to get his humans work? Look into it, people. That's all I'm saying. Look into it. He'd be lower, but he got his fucking tongue ripped out. And it's hilarious. Goddamn hilarious. Craig McTavish, S-tier mascot for ripping out Harvey the Hound's tongue. Look at this thing. Look at it. We're just going to leave that here. You know what? Here, here's going to be the stream for the rest of the night. And that way, people who are like, oh, Toogie, it's actually good. You're right, right? People are going to be, oh, Toogie, it's, it's actually a good mascot. Oh, really? We'll see how you feel after looking at this fucking nonsense for the rest of the night. How, do, how about that? How about that, right? We'll we'll just move me up here, and uh, we'll do a little bit of a little bit of magic, right? We'll just do a little bit of a little bit of Hollywood magic, and uh, once we're once we're done with the stream tonight, you can go ahead and let me know just how S tier you think this son of a bitch is. Because I guarantee, by the end of the night, you're going to break. You are going to break. I guarantee it. There you go. You got your wish. Here we are. Congratulations. You go ahead and tell me how this is an S-tier mascot. You go right ahead. You go right ahead. Ridiculous. Like I said, I'll see you in four years. When it's become such a meme that we all consider it A tier anyway. So congrats to the early adopters. You're going to look smart. You just got to wait for it. Be patient. Jesus.